Hey, what's up, travelers? So in this video, we're getting packed to go on our next trip. I'm really excited. So yeah, it's been a long time. Haven't made a video since the beginning of January of last year, 2022. A lot has happened since then. I ended up starting a business trying to pay off my student loans where I was going out to garage sales and thrift stores and buying stuff and then flipping it on eBay. And I was well on my way to doing that. In the middle of September, my dad died. And then it was, it was crazy. As soon as my dad died, my eBay store sales, they just plummeted down to almost nothing. I was selling on Amazon and my sales on Amazon plummeted down to almost nothing. At the same time, the views on my YouTube went from about 5,000 views per video down to about 100 views every week. I just felt just completely devastated. I, my entire world crashed around me. So I panicked and I thought, oh my God, I gotta quit being me. I went and I worked for Starbucks for about three months and then I just ended up waking up one day and I said, I just can't do this. So now I'm heading back to Vietnam for an entire month. I'm gonna move on and maybe 45 days in Thailand before I head back because I still have to deal with my dad's estate and everything like that. That's what's been going on with me. That's why I've taken this last couple months off from from uploading to youtube there's just been so much on my plate and it's been absolutely insane but here we are we're getting ready to go i'm super excited so let's get packed here so what am i taking with me i like to prefer to travel carry on only uh that way i don't have to check any bags and worry about bags getting lost and everything picked up this the suitcase, it's a level 8 suitcase. It's really nice hard shell suitcase. It's got a flap on the front where you can put your your laptop, your iPad, or you know, anything that you need to have quick access to while you're going through security. So you just unzip one zipper and then boom, it's right there. You can take it out. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. That's the stupidest thing I've ever said. And then it's also got uh, a TSA approved lock on it. Uh, the wheels are just flawless. 360 wheels, all four of them. And it is absolutely nice. And, and then it's got a really a nice tall handle to it. So it's really cool. And on the inside, there is a lot of of room probably one of the nicest suitcases i've ever had so what are we going to put into it all right well when i go traveling i like to start out with fresh factory sealed underwear socks i will take two pairs of shorts with me and a pair of jeans that i'm going to wear onto the plane with me and then I'm gonna pack one shirt and I'm gonna wear one shirt and then I'm gonna wear my puffer jacket as well. It's really cool. I can just crunch it down and it takes up about literally this much room. No matter where I go, it's hot, cold. I have that jacket with me in case the weather happens to go crazy or I end up going on a, on a trip up into the mountains or something. I have that jacket to take with me. And that's what I'm taking as far as clothes. Yeah, two shirts. Yeah, I know that's, that's not much, but the reason why I'm only taking two shirts is because I want one for when I'm on the plane. I want one from when I get off the plane so I can fresh it up. And then after that, I can just go buy some shirts. Fairly inexpensive over there, so it's a good deal. So another thing that I'm going to definitely be taking with me a day pack backpack. This is just a little tiny backpack. This is going to allow me to carry the stuff that I need to carry when I'm out doing the things that I'm doing, like recording videos and stuff like that. I can put everything all in here and I will have everything I need. Plus I'll have room to put stuff if I pick it up while I'm, while I'm on the go. Something that, that I've done here is I've put these KeySmart quick disconnect uh, little carabiner clips. They're really cool. I've I've got I've got two of my my uh, zipper poles attached to each other. I have fairly easy access to be able to to undo them and then zip and then put it back together. But thieves are going to have to fiddle around with it. 
So it's definitely a big deterrent for pickpockets. Definitely don't want to get pickpocketed while you're on the road. August of 2021, I was my first 10 minutes in Naples, Italy. I got pickpocketed for my passport and my vaccination card. And because of that, I had to end my trip early and go home and get everything back together and then head on back out. And it sucked. So yeah, I got that. And then I'm going to... I'm going to take my full-size backpack as well. It will be my, my plus one. The day pack's going to go into the suitcase because i got plenty of room in the suitcase. And then I've got this camera bag here that has, uh, it's got its own little carabiner uh, built into the, to the clip. So it's, uh, it's one that you have to twist to open. So another thing thieves are going to have an issue with. So this is where I'm going to keep my GoPro and all my batteries for the GoPro and charging cables and everything like that. So that's going to be really easy. I'll also keep my power bank. What else am I taking here? Well, I don't have my computer down here in front of me, but I'm going to be taking my computer and that's going to go right in the front pocket of that the suitcase and then of course power bank you need a power bank definitely definitely need a power bank especially if you're out filming videos and stuff like that international charge point uh, definitely need one of these because let's face it our plugins are not the same as the plugins around the world but this definitely helps convert that over uh, definitely gonna want one of these. Let's see, what else do we got here? Oh yeah, TSA approved locks. That way, if you're in a hostel or something like that, you can you can just use one of these. And this is a this is a a combination code, so you don't need any keys or anything like that. And if you put it on your suitcases or something like that, TSA has a key that they can open it up so they can check your bags if they need to. So that's handy. GoPro battery chargers and batteries. And it also has, has a place here to, to keep the, the memory cards and everything like that. And then we've got another one. If I can get it open. Yeah. So I roll with seven batteries for my GoPro because those things run through it. <laughs> okay. And then an external hard drive this one is a five terabyte hard drive it should be enough to get me through the two and a half months that i am gone shaving stuff we got a razor blades and a couple things of shaving cream here that are under the tsa allotment so these are 88 milliliters or three fluid ounces each so as long as i keep them in the bag and I'm able to pull them out of the bag during TSA. It should be okay to go. A toothbrush, of course. Uh, I use these uh, toothpaste pills here. So you just grab these. You don't have to worry about having the liquid allowance or anything like that. You just take one, pop it in your mouth, chew it up, and then use your uh, toothbrush to brush like normal. And there you go. And the same same idea. I got this cologne here. It's also kind of a deodorant type of thing as well. It's a solid cologne. And it smells awesome. This is the Duke Cannon Supply Company solid cologne, concentrated cologne balm. It's uh oak barrel bourbon flavor, uh, scented <laughs> flavored. <laughs> but there's an ounce and a half of it and I'm I'm pretty sure there's no way I'm going to go through this much when in two and a half months. Just not a, not a chance. Wet wipes. You get on a plane. You can't you can't be sure that 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 seat around you is clean. So get on a plane. Use these. This is going in the main backpack, so I have good easy access to it. And uh, yeah. That plane's going to be clean around me when I sit there. <laughs> You're going to want cords and cables and stuff like that. So that's pretty much what I'm taking with me. I'm using this new microphone here. 
I picked it up on Amazon. I've been looking for something that, that is wireless and works with an iPhone. And I found this and I found another one over here. So I'm kind of testing them both out. So I'll be bringing both of these here. Yeah, here's, here's this one. It's got a little clip here. And uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. And then you just plug this piece into the bottom of the phone and uh, it transmits and receives. It's a pretty good deal. Uh, I'm hoping, I haven't used the one I'm using right now. So I'm hoping that the audio is pretty good, but we'll have to check that out. So I picked these ones up here up on Amazon and uh, these ones I found on Instagram actually. They're the only thing I've ever bought off Instagram. They were like, I think $40. And so I bought that and then I thought that they were taking a while to get here. I was thinking maybe I got scammed or something like that. So then I went looking on, on Amazon and I found these ones. And it was really cool because I found a coupon that ended up making it so instead of paying 40 bucks for for these microphones and I got two of them and they come with a with the charging case here uh, I ended up with the coupon that they had I ended up actually getting paid seven dollars to get them so instead of paying 40 I got paid seven bucks to get them and what a deal <laughs> anyway so that's what I'm that's what I'm taking with me when I go out on, on, on the road. I, there may be a couple things that I've left out. Oh, yeah, I, I wear glasses now. So uh, <laughs> I'll be taking some of those with me as well. Uh, maybe you'll see some in the videos. I don't know. Uh, reading has been getting difficult. <laughs> I think that's pretty much everything I'm taking with me. I hope you enjoyed the video. If so, like, subscribe. And join me on this new adventure going to Vietnam and Thailand. We're going to have a hell of a time. We're going to eat some amazing food. We're going to see some amazing places. And it's going to be a great time. So as always, eat great food.